You know, it's funny. I decided to stream Call of Duty World War Two for whatever reason. I, I probably couldn't tell you. And within the space of an hour, I wanted to throw my PS4 through the window because I'd just gotten that fed up with doing it. And then I remembered that there was something new on one of my favourite games, Paladins. And there's a new character. I'm probably very late to the party with this, but what you're watching in the background is some gameplay with the new character, Vivian. And let's just say Vivian is... A little bit of a savage bitch is probably the right way of saying it. How are you doing, everybody? It's Gibbon. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for stopping by. So, yeah, as you are watching in the background, it's a little bit of Paladin's gameplay, pushing the payload along and uh, playing as Vivian. I think it's around about a 40 kill gameplay, something to that effect. I go on a nice little 15 streak um, and just trying out a new character now just to do the uh, housekeeping of this section, uh, just to go through her skills. So, she's a damaged character and her skills are obviously she has a light machine gun and what that does is you can fire a shot every 0.14 seconds dealing 200 damage effective up to medium range while firing your movement is 50% slower you've got precision sight so you can aim down sight basically and you gain improved accuracy but again your movement is 50% slower you've got a defector shield so you project a frontal shield that blocks 1400 damage for 6 seconds and you can fire while your defective shield is deflector sorry shield is active sensor drone i properly failed with this thing multiple times i'm trying to throw it out i ended up throwing it against walls constantly so it's a deployable sensor that reveals enemies to you in a large radius and then we get to the um the nice point the ultimate sentinels now the description of this is that you can summon two sentinel drones that fire energy blasts while you shoot your light machine gun each sentinel fires once per second, dealing 200 damage. Sentinels persist until destroyed or the player is killed. So, just to point that out, ladies and gentlemen, you can get your ultimate and your ultimate will carry on until somebody either destroys your sentinels or you are killed. That It's just, it's almost like an everlasting ultimate. It is extremely OP and it's highly amusing at the same time as well. Uh, we weren't playing with the front line in this. For whatever reason, I don't know why, it's only casual, so you can't really bitch about it or complain. It's just one of those things. I didn't feel like flexible in, I wanted to play the new character, and she's just brilliant. Her accuracy is bonkers. She's like, think Victor, but with 80 bullets in his gun, and more accurate as well. I've also purchased, I've got a three-day lease of the golden weapon as well. I just decided, fuck it, I might as well get the golden weapon just for a little bit of fun. But once I kind of got into the groove with it, I found her really, really good. I found what I would do, as you can see here, I'd pop my shield up, pop my ultimate up, and then just go to town with it as well. And this is what ends up being play of the game. As you can see, nice little triple kill that goes into that. It's lovely, just enjoyable. She's just a really, really good character to play, in all honesty. Really enjoyed it. Um, the one thing is, is I'm really used to playing Victor, so I keep pressing shift to, to do the hustle. Obviously, forgetting that I'm not Victor, so what I end up doing, because it's your left shift, I'm throwing out the deployable drone all the time and looking like a complete just tit. It was just ridiculous, just one of those really stupid things that I just couldn't get to grips with. But as the gameplay went on, I got better and better and better. I've got a selection of cards with her as well, so just things to like reduce the recoil. I've changed up the card loadout. That's what I tend to do now with when I get new characters just change up the loadout just something that i think is going to make it a bit better for me so things like increased shield increased ability um increased uh, healing that kind of stuff so those types of cards are just for me because it's a new character i just want the best chance possible while i'm playing and like i said i had a lot of fun with her she is this bit here is quite amusing because i had them all in this little section here and for whatever reason i forgot to put my shield up I don't know why, I just completely forgot to put it up and I just put my ultimate up. If I'd had my shield up, I could have taken out everybody, like everybody. But Snake Boy managed to kill me. But yeah, like I said, overall, really, really great character to play. Really, really enjoyable. I had a good time playing it and it's nice to be playing Paladins again. I don't often upload a lot of Paladins because I prefer to play it to enjoy it. And sometimes when you want to upload it, it ends up being a game that you try to play just to get gameplay when it should be about enjoying it at the moment i'm going to bring a bit more palin into the channel but yeah if you've not tried vivian yet try her out she is immense fun and again you can see gibbon coming in with the play of the game just as we like to do
that's going to do it for this one, guys. I do hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please don't forget to click the like button. If you're new to this channel, please also don't forget to subscribe. This has been OG Gibbon, and we are out of here, ladies and gentlemen. Peace.